Governor of the Eastern Caribbean Central Bank, Timothy N.J. Antwine, is expressing concern that the unemployment rate in the Caribbean region remains high. Addressing various private sector entities during the Eggs and Issues event hosted by the Dominica Association of Industry and Commerce yesterday, Antoine indicated that the rate is simply unacceptable. Unemployment is simply too high in our region. You know that well, especially among our youth. In some countries, the average is around 20%, 25%, and then the youth is double, so the youth is 40%, 50%. That's a recipe for problems. In the Caribbean, youth unemployment rates are among the highest in the world, a May 2016 Caribbean Development Bank report showed. Based on that report, Dominica has unemployment has an unemployment rate of 23%. The governor remarked that one cannot deny the correlation between unemployment and some of the social pathologies plaguing the region. He also mentioned that not just the unemployed adversely impact the economy, but the underemployed as well. A striving and thriving citizenry. This is where our people feel that they're not just working hard, but they're making it. They're getting ahead. Because you know there are some people who feel like they're working hard, but they're not making any progress. And it's really important for people to have a sense of progress as they put in the hours and put in the time and uh, make the sacrifices to grow themselves, their families, and their countries. So that's Despite the various challenges, though, Governor Antoine commented that the financial outlook for the region is promising. Well, and lots is going on. The outlook for our economy, the ECC economy, which by the way is a 17 billion strong economy with a population of 630,000. And I make this point because very often we think about the national economies without reflection on the broader economy, which is the space in which we have to operate. And so that should be our thinking and our mindset. So the outlook for our regional economy is broadly positive notwithstanding the issues, the risks that abound, and there are several risks. Having said that, having said that, I make the point that for us to move to the next level, for us to really achieve transformation, which is what we envisage, we have to undertake some critical reforms, and we need to do so with urgency. And we need to do so with urgency. Reforms that will lift the level of growth, the trajectory, and employment, and ultimately move us towards transformation. He stressed that regional cooperation is essential to see the kind of socio-economic transformation that the ECCB is hoping to achieve. Issues which are national, and yes, there are national responses that are appropriate. For example, your dealings with Erica. But I contend that many of the challenges that we face in our region can best be handled through regional approaches. They're not necessarily easy, but that is the way we have to go. Public engagement is important in order to share ideas and then come together to take collective action, said Governor Antoine. The DAIC's Egg and Issues event was held under the theme Improving Monetary Stability Through Growth, Competitiveness and Employment. <laughs>